Welcome to this Novels and Works demonstration video. This demonstration shows you how to install and license the Jaspersoft Studio Professional software, and then connect Jaspersoft Studio to your existing and Works reporting server. In order to create interactive reports, your first step is to download the Jaspersoft Studio ISO from the Novell download site to the Windows device, where you want to run Jaspersoft Studio Professional. After downloading the ISO, mount the ISO and execute the setup program. Choose the language that you want, and then accept the license agreement. After you specify the installation directory, you can begin the installation. After the installation is completed, launch Jaspersoft Studio Professional. When the application starts, Specify the workspace root path to create the workspace directory. The first thing you should do is apply your Jaspersoft Studio license. Go to the License Manager page. Click Install New License. Browse to your Jasper Server license file. Then install the license. After installing the license, you need to ensure that Jaspersoft Studio Professional can communicate securely with Zenworks reporting server. To do so, you first need to access Zenworks reporting server. Then navigate to the security folder and copy the server.cert file to the Jaspersoft Studio Professional device. Launch the command prompt and navigate to the JRE directory. From the JRE directory, execute the command that is required to import the Zenworks reporting certificate. Now you need to configure the server connection. To do so, launch Jaspersoft Studio Professional. Navigate to the Show View page, select Repository Explorer. Then in the repository, click Create Jasper Report Server Connection. Specify the name of the connection, doesn't works reporting URL, and the administrator's credentials. Click Test Connection to validate the connection. After a successful connection is established, save the connection. Doesn't works reporting content is displayed on the Repository Explorer. Now, when you navigate to the Zenworks reporting folder report structure, the structure contains the same reports that are available in the Zenworks reporting server. For more Zenworks reporting information and resources, visit the Zenworks 11 SP3 documentation site. Thanks for watching.